How's it going folks? Mike with New Way Ag. I had to start out in the field here so you could get a perspective of how big this trailer is. What is this trailer? This is the New Way Ag Mega Trailer. We built this trailer to do mega fields carry a lot more fluid, operate three drones from the top. We're gonna go over the whole trailer. We're gonna get closer to it, but I started this clip just to, so you can see how big this trailer is. So let's get close to it and we'll go over the details. As I said, it's the New Way Ag Mega Trailer. So it has a lot of the same features as the standard New Way trailer. If you guys haven't seen that launch video, make sure to go over there and watch that one. But it starts off with the whole trailer is powder coated. So everything that is metal is powder coated. So you're gonna get three to six times stronger, thicker paint than normal wet paint. We have aluminum stairs and aluminum railings up top to help the trailer be lighter. Now, the thing is, this is a heavy duty trailer, but it weighs a lot to be able to carry a lot. You have a 42 foot flight deck up top, one single composite deck spanning that 42 feet. And then on the bottom, we have a 32 foot deck over trailer, obviously gooseneck. Now this isn't just a standard goose. We actually extended this goose to be higher above your truck that way if you get on uneven surfaces where your truck is like tilting or whatever you won't hit your trailer on your truck so we extended the goose to be higher and then on the front of the actual goose where you hook it up to your truck it has this torsion um, anyhow it makes the ride a lot nicer I forget exactly what the name is of that hitch there but it, it helps with torsion if you're you know, going over bumps or whatever, but every trailer, mega trailer will come with that. Starting up front, in the front of the Goose, we have this toolbox here. You can put tools and stuff in here, but you also have a power dual hydraulic jacks. It will come with two dual hydraulic jacks to hook and unhook your trailer. It makes it really nice. You can hook your trailer up and off real quick. I don't know if we have to get this technical, but they're in the middle of this trailer. You got two big I-beams. In the center of that, you have a torsion bar. It's basically, if you look underneath the trailer, it's to help with the torquing of the, the trailer itself because it is this big and this long. The trailer can flex this way, so they put a rod through it to strengthen it so it won't do that. It's pretty cool. Check out this big thing. It hooks up in the front and runs all the way into the back right by the axles to, to get that strength really nice as on all our standard new way trailers we have a, a light switch here it'll help illuminate your bottom deck as well as on the top we have a pilot protection area that is illuminated and the takeoff and landing area has a, a light bar shining on it here you have one two three four lights in the bottom to illuminate down here then we come back here the axles dual 15k axles you're looking at 30,000 pounds being able to be thrown onto this trailer we'll get into the tank system a little bit later this is what we call the mike's loadout so we'll get into that we're just going to walk around in the back here these are i call them gussets some people don't know what a gusset is but i didn't know what a one was until somebody told me it's to help strengthen the trailer but it's also really nice to add your own logos to it so you have a nice surface there for your own logos then on the back of the trailer trailer here are the lights for turn signals as well as reverse lights and backup lights so this trailer has that on it i used to think well ah, why do you need it well it's actually really nice for safety one if i put that thing in reverse and there's somebody standing back here they're gonna know i'm going to back up and it also helps to illuminate that area when you're doing nighttime operations backing up your trailer i guess we don't really have to walk down this side actually yeah well, let's show you the generator setup as you guys know i love dji generators because they work great with the system. They charge the fastest what power to weight ratio, meaning what this thing weighs to how much power it puts out. There's no other generator out there that can keep up with this. They're going to be running three drones off of this trailer and they needed three DJI generators. So two on the bottom and one on top gives us just enough cord to get that up top to have their charge boxes in front by the pilot protection wall. The tires on the mega trailer are all 18 ply tires. That gives you those heavy duty beefy tires to be able to carry that heavy load that you might wanna carry on this thing. Let's go over the loadout. This is the loadout that we helped this company that bought this trailer. They want it to be able to have clean water. This will be clean water. And this is where they're going to do all their mixing. But it did, they wanted a second pump 
to be able to pump only water and never be contaminated. We're gonna go over the tank system now on the mega trailer. This is what we call the Mike's loadout. Comes with a hundred gallon clear water, clean water tank. This is just to spray down your drones or your flight deck or whatever you might want that never gets contaminated. Also comes with a 50 foot retractable water hose. It's not mounted yet, but it will be mounted down here. This is a 300 gallon induction tank. So this is where they'll do their mixing in here. And two pumps, a Honda 5.5 horse. So it's a two inch pump with two inch hose. You're pumping about 200 gallons a minute. And we have two of them, one on that side and one on this side. Now, the reason we went with that setup is this company didn't want to have one of these be contaminated. They want to be able to suck water out of something or whatever. They want it two pumps. And the way we plumbed this up is pump A sucks the water from the front, dumps it in there, and pump B then circulates and then pushes the pressure up top to fill their drones. After looking at it and uh, seeing how we were able to engineer it and figure it out how to run it efficiently, I'm thinking that all trailers that want a backup pump, this would be a very nice option for them. That's it well, along with a 1600 gallon tank. So if you do it right, if they fill their water in the morning, if they fill this with water and then add their chemical once they get to the field, they fill this and they have this full of water, they're gonna be able to do 950 acres if they are doing two gallons an acre. 950 acres off of one load, they're gonna get some acres done. I'm telling you, I think the efficiency is gonna be incredible. That is the mega trailer. I mean, it is mega. It weighs a lot. You're looking at right at 11,000 pounds for the trailer to be empty, like nothing on it. But we also didn't spare on heavy metal and quality metal. We did not want this trailer to you know, flex in any way. There is more weight with it, but you hook a big enough truck onto it, it'll pull it just fine. So that's enough about the tanks. Let's go up top, check out the flight deck. Before we go up here, obviously easy access stairs. Like they're not ladders where you go straight up. So a gradually sloped stair as well as this access door, lightweight, but built out of same composite material as the flight deck. So we go up top here and check it out. You can operate three drones from this trailer. Now, of course, I wouldn't recommend flying them with each other like that. You would want to try to stagger them, give yourself a little bit more room from the pilot protection area to your first drone but for transportation and times when you need to get those three drones back at the same time, you can do that with this mega trailer. Another thing I didn't point out when we were down there is you do get a retractable chemical hose built into your floor. You just pull it out, you lock it in, then you pull it out again to reel it back up. This trailer has the battery chargers up in the front here, pilot protection wall, this is a nice feature to be able, if you're operating your drone back here, let's say something happens, you gotta get away from it, you can come down and protect yourself. This railing is really nice. I used to think I didn't like the tubing, but we have a new super clamp that you guys are gonna wanna check out if you're operating this. There's a clamp, you just super clamp it onto there, take your uh, controller, you can just click it on there, have a fast release, take your controller off. Really nice. You can move that super clamp around onto these railings. It's also nice, you know, just to hang out like this. That's about all I got for you guys on the new way trailer. Let's go down and we'll finish this thing on the ground. Okay, so coming down off the trailer, because it is a deck over trailer, it is quite high from the road, but I wanted that for clearance when you're going off road. But we added this easy access step, so getting onto the trailer is not that difficult, and the step is bumped out just slightly to be able to see it to come down. So you step on there, really easy to get off of the trailer. Now, the overall height of this trailer from the ground to the railing is 13 foot two inches, keeping you under that 13 six for legally allowing you to transfer this down most highways. Something I wanna point out on this mega trailer is because of that extra deck space on the bottom, 32 feet, they have so much more room to put things like up here from this tank to the front of where the goose is, you could easily stack chemicals in there if you want, have your own box. And then also on the back, you got so much room back here, you could easily have a drone security box on the back, as well as something sitting right in here, maybe like a Suron dirt bike or something like that when you're out in the field. There it is, that is the mega trailer, the New Way Ag mega trailer. Let's recap what you're gonna get with this. It is a 42 foot flight deck up top with a one single composite deck. 
built on a 32 foot deck over with a gooseneck. On that gooseneck, you get a torsion hitch as well as dual hydraulic jacks, two 15K axles, and eight 18 ply tires on that thing. So it is a heavy duty trailer for mega fields. Get yours at New Way Ag. We'll see you guys on the next one.